Okay, here we go. We got the uh, infamous uh, practice uh, urchin hammer. I got uh, six prongs on this side. And I also got three larger ones on this side. There's a hole all the way down the middle to help it uh, go through the water a little cleaner without uh, letting the water flow down the middle was kind of the idea. Put a brass piece here to help uh, tighten up that joint. I can trim part of this off to change the weight, but we'll see how Matt uh, likes that. On the back side, I put a, a guard to help uh, protect his hand a little bit if, if, it, if the, it's your, he's banging out urchins. So hopefully he'll just hammer it and not be poking at him. But I figured that looked a cool, so I put that on there. The handle is from a, um, a motorcycle peg. It's actually a test part initially for uh, some custom motorcycles in Australia and I had that in my pile of stuff there so I figured I'd use that. I bored out the bottom to get the weight down some then he's got his uh, typical lanyard so he doesn't drop it and lose it to the depths of the ocean. So we'll get him to hand fit it and we're gonna put his glove on and see how it fits on there. Definitely feels different with the glove versus not so uh, we might be working on that handle a little bit more when he shows up but we'll take it out he'll take it out to the uh, urchin uh, event here at the end of the month and um, see how it all goes okay there's the uh, infamous uh, purple urchin uh, device okay